No government can put any system in place to prevent certain crimes from being committed. This from Minister of Labor Jennifer Batiste Primus. Uh, she made the statement during her contribution in the Senate on the continuation of the private motion to deal with the unacceptable level of crime in Trinidad and Tobago. Madam President, you have a love triangle gone wrong. A man decides that this woman is my possession, not a human being, but someone that I possessed. And if I can't have her, nobody else will, and decides to take the law into his hands and take the life of, 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 of a sister, a woman, a mother, a grandmother. A government cannot prevent those crimes. Committing a crime, she said, was an individual's choice. People take a decision recently, young, young citizens of a particular place, literally hogtied one of our beloved persons of the cloth. They were the same persons he has been helping over the years, Madam President. He said there's need for a comprehensive strategy to combat crime this government considers the prevention of crime as a national priority. We want a crime-free society. We want to be able not to have to um, place ourselves literally behind bars because when we burglar proof our homes, that, that is what we do. We owe it to our people, we owe it to our children, we owe it to ourselves. Madam President, we also recognize that the causes of crime are deep-rooted and multi-dimensional. The motion was brought by opposition Senator Wayne Stage in April, stating that government had failed to address the extraordinary increase in the level of crime in Trinidad and Tobago. In responding to Mrs. Batiste Primus, opposition Senator Daniel Solomon said he did not agree that government was not responsible for crime that the government is responsible and the Honorable Prime Minister had said himself that if the government cannot solve the problem of crime then they are part of the problem. Unfortunately the situation is that this present government has failed in their efforts to curb crime and crime is unfortunately spiraling way out of control and if something drastic is not done then certainly all is lost. More focus needs to be placed on social programs. I'm not here to, 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 to prepare to listen to hear that, oh, it is just a matter that it's not the government's problem mm -hmm. and it's a family problem and it's a choice of, a bad choice of, 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 of lover. Mm -hmm. No, that is not acceptable. These institutions need the support and the resources to tackle the problem frontally. Independent Senator Melissa Ramkisun said another issue contributing to crime was the breakdown of family life in Trinidad and Tobago. Parents or guardians need to be charged when their children are found in crimes or performing criminal activities, be it minor or major or serious. 